Hey, how you doing? Ben Broussard with Loga here with this week's drilling report. Getting you guys up to speed. The Haynesville Shale Golf Classic has been rescheduled due to this monsoon. New date is Monday, April 27th at Southern Trace in Shreveport, Louisiana. A few teams still available. Buzz me for registration info at ben at loga.la. Also, 2015 Loga Sporting Clays happening on June 5th at the beautiful Las Paloma. First flight filling up. Special discounted industry crunch pricing, helping you guys network and shoot this year. Get your team together and register online today. All right, starting things off with the latest prices. Louisiana Light Suite bumps a few bucks to $57.58 a barrel. May Henry Hub Gas down to $2.51 per MMBTU. EIA Hub Spot Price through the 6th of the month comes in at $2.63 per MMBTU. Current U.S. Rig Count in the triple digits at $9.88, dropping 40 rigs in the last week down 843 from a year prior. Okay, starting off in the Haynesville, Uno new permits this week for JW Operating. This one for an alternate unit well at DeSoto's Caspiana. Five wells to market since last report, most in DeSoto. EP Energy currently drilling at DeSoto's Hollyfield, spud late last month. Pre-production numbers in the shale dropped to 290. As for the whole of North Louisiana, Wild Horse adds two new spuds in the past month for Lincoln Parish. North Louisiana adds one to end out at 25 rigs. Over to the TMS, all rigs shut down for the time being. TMS pre-production numbers stand at 12. Moving on to South Louisiana, drops recorded in Allen, Jeff Davis, Avoyles, and St. Mary Parishes. Iberville, however, shows life with two running projects, Ponderosa drilling in Dorseyville and PetroQuest spudding at West Maringouin. Finally, Vermilion Parish seeing new action from Square Mile Energy in the Abbeville field. In the end, South Louisiana ends out in the single digits with eight rigs on land. Inland water still a bit iffy out here. Hill Corp spuds at Freshwater Bayou in Vermilion Parish this week. Even with that, inland water sits at four running rigs. Louisiana State Offshore Waters, nothing doing out here. Finally, Outer Continental Shelf Federal Drilling drops another two to end out at 30 running federal OCS drilling projects. As a whole, Louisiana ended out at 67 active projects for the week, same as last week, and making history every week it sits here. Now, as for deep water permits and hope Hopefully a sign of good things to come. Six of these, most at Green Canyon. One for Freeport McMoran at Green Canyon, block 643. One for BHP Billiton at Green Canyon, block 609. Another for Anadarko at Green Canyon, block 561. Finally, one for BP at Green Canyon, block 825. Two at Mississippi Canyon, one for Stat Oil at block 814. The other for Log at block 546. Shallow water, we even have one here. This one for Arena Offshore at Eugene Island, block 338. Back on land, 14 new permits to drill in six Louisiana parishes, most in Lincoln Parish. Six permits there. No surprise as Lincoln is by far the busiest parish in the state of Louisiana with 12 running rigs. These six permits all for memorial resource development. Badger Energy permits on land at the Borg Field in Lafouche Parish. The remaining a handful of shallow permits for independence in the north. This week's permits went out in Bienville, Caddo, Concordia, DeSoto, Lafouche, and Lincoln Parishes. You want a little more info? Be sure and check out the Office of Conservation's website. Hey, thanks to you guys for listening to this report and sharing it with the folks you know. Click this button right here to share it on up. Don't forget to follow Loga for up-to-date news on the oil and gas industry in Louisiana. Until next time, this is Ben Broussard with Loga TV.